Mountain of Ireland, mounted by the Kenya Defense Forces, present and ready for inspection, sir. Asante ni kwa heshima tunaweza kuketi tafadhali. Anayemsindikiza Mheshimiwa Rais ni Mkuu wa Majeshi ya Ulinzi, Jenerali Robert Kibochi.
tutulie tafadhali wananchi nitampisha mwenzangu bwana wanjohi aweze kuendelea naomba sote tutulie kwa maombi may i most humbly request that we observe a moment of silence as we are led in prayers starting with Mze Olenkaru, an elder of the Maasai community. Tuombe wanainchi. Nama mashu. Nama yama ginya. Nama yama sarganya ginya. Arasa yanga yaya. Ngai basi nai, nai rama yana la presidenti no loito, uhuru ginyarra, jo mehe manga yana rendio dicho, jo mehe mau merenga yana yana presidenti, merenga saking yana yana, merenga saking do robungkung, merenga saking kado rio tuan, mehe malaki jaga dulu dicho, yo boy dia no mono nene, fasiliti, magir ginyarra. Ara saya, naik jam lagi aku lari ramon, warori bokin nanti rejo sudua. Ara saya angkai, angkai, aromono, aromono adalah presiden. Yedilikin Norlo, William Samuel Ruto, naik jam tu Norlo, jam merobiko, jam meramayana. Nama yang masuk kalian ni, joru rakyat ni, nama yang mengkara ni nak, nama yang masuk kalian nadi, naik dari joso dua, arah saya yang kaya, arah monu, arah saya, arah monu, angkaya yang monu dua presiden nadi, dia beri presiden, kasih gua, beri gua sih nak ini arah joso dua. Nainja itu borlo, nainja sorua, yang dobih, yang dobih ni dia, yang dobih ni dia, yang nak melono, yang nak robilo, yang nak robilo nak raya la nai unde, yang nak robilo nak sendu lemedo, yang nak bikin nak dunyo, yang nak bikin nak dunyo ko, yang nak bikin nak dunyo geri, yang nak bikin nak dunyo lewa imerek, arasanya. Aromon, Ashole. Atakuyata sasa Kano Father Dr. Benjamin Mwasweli wa majeshi ya ulinzi. In the name of the Father and of the Son and the Holy Spirit, Amen. Almighty ever living God, you are the Lord of the universe who has us merciful to your creation. You are God of power and might, wisdom and justice. Through you, authority is rightly administered, laws are enacted, and the judgment is decreed. We come before you seeking for blessings upon this great nation. Bless His Excellency Honorable Uhuru Kenyatta, President of the Republic of Kenya and the Commanding Chief of Kenya Defense Forces. We pray for his entire family, safeguard them, send your Holy Spirit. So that through your Honorable Dr. William Samuel Luto and all his elected leaders, send your Holy Spirit upon them, grant them your divine wisdom, so that they may seek to preserve peace promote national happiness, and continue to bring us blessings of unity and prosperity. We appeal to your compassion. Stay with the close to those whom you have chosen, and lead them to lead this great nation. We ask this through Christ our Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Atafuyata Sasa Sheikh Faisal, Abayani Director of Religious Studies, Subkem. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim.
kila jinsi ya sifa njema ni ya kuendo undugu na maendeleo tunakuomba katika hii siku ya leo wakati tunamwaga rais wetu uhuru kinyata mungu tunakushuhudia umbarikie katika maisha yake kazi yake ilikuwa ni mzuri na tupo hapa kushuhudia uwapisho wa rais wetu mteule naye ni rais Samuel William, William Samuel Ruto tunaomba Mungu umsaidie rais huyu pamoja na wasaidizi wake na wote waliocheguliwa katika kuendesha nchi yetu wainue uchumi na wakomeshe ufisadi wainue uadilifu na wakomeshe unyanyasaji wafanye yale unayoridhika nayo wewe Allah uliowatuma manabii wako sisi ni waja wako tunakuasi tusamehe madhambi yetu na vile vile usituadhibu kwa makosa wanayoyafanya wale wasiokujali mwisho nawatakia rehma na amani watumishi wako mtume wetu Muhammad mtume wetu Isa Masih mtume wetu Musa mtume wetu Ibrahim baba yetu Adam na manabii wote Mungu ibariki Kenya amin asanteni atakaye tufungia kipindi hiki cha maombi ni Reverend Teresia Wairimu Kinyajui founder of the Faith Evangelistic Ministry Father we thank you the psalmist says This is the day that the Lord has made that we may rejoice and be glad in it Father we want to thank you for this great day that you have made We are so grateful for what you have done in the nation of Kenya Thank you God for the peace of God that surpasses the understanding of man God you have held us together in unity and God how I pray this day that Kenya will be a nation under God and the peace of God will continue to prevail in this nation dear Lord I thank you for the great people of this nation of Kenya and be glad in it Heavenly Father we thank you for our outgoing president Uhuru Muigai Kenyatta and his lovely wife Her Excellency Margaret Kenyatta we speak a blessing over them and their family their children almighty God we thank you for entrusting him to serve this nation for the past 10 years we give you glory and we give you honor and now dear Lord we want to thank you for the incoming president of the Republic of Kenya our faith president We thank you, God Almighty, for granting us Dr. William Samuel Ruto to be our faith president and his deputy, Gachago and Pastor Dokas. God, we thank you for them. We pray that God, will you, your hand will be upon them. We ask that God, they will have grace of leadership, that they will take this nation to the next level. Oh, give you praise i ask that god you remember you will remember the judiciary almighty god that god almighty they will continue to expand and extend their services so that the kenyans will enjoy the services of justice in this nation in the name of the lord so we thank you for our cj Uh, Justice Mother Komi, the President of the Supreme Court, and her entire team in the name of Jesus, remember and dedicate our 47 counties before the hand of the Almighty God. We pray for every county in the name of Jesus. We pray, Almighty, that the hand of God will be upon every governor, the House of the Senate, the members of Parliament, the, the women representatives and the MCAs, oh God, let your hand be upon them. Dear Lord, we also want to thank you for the great friends of this nation of Kenya. We thank you for every president, every prime minister, those that you have granted to come and celebrate this day with us. We ask that your hand will be upon them and 
their nations and your blessing will come upon them. So Heavenly Father, we also ask you to bless every diplomat, every ambassador, every commission in the name of Jesus. And God, as we come to the swearing uh, part of this ceremony, we ask that God, you grace this occasion with your presence, almighty God. Let your hand be upon this nation in the name of Jesus. For we pray and ask this in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. We pray and we believe. And everybody say, Amen. Asante Nisana Skofu, Your Excellency, Honorable Uhuru Kenyatta, President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander-in-Chief of the Defense Forces, and Your Excellency, First Lady Mama Margaret Kenyatta, Your Excellency, Honorable Dr. William Samoei Ruto, President-elect of the Republic of Kenya, and First Lady-in-waiting, Mama Rachel Ruto, Excellencies and the President of the Supreme Court, elected leaders, Wanainchi wa Jamhuri Tuipendayo, Mabibi na Mabwana. Your Excellencies, it is now my distinct honor and privilege to invite the Deputy Chief Register of the Judiciary, Honorable Paul Demo, to take his position at the inauguration arena and guide the proceedings. Honorable Demo. Thank you very much. Paul Joseph Were, Senior Principal Magistrate. The judiciary mess signifies judicial authority. Under Article 159 of the Constitution, judicial authority is vested in the people but is exercised by the judiciary. On top of the head of the mace is mounted the coat of arms, which is one of our national symbols. On the sides, it is emblazoned with the judiciary logo and the scales of justice. Thank you very much. Arena in order to administer both the oath of allegiance and the oath of due execution of the office. And the deputy president-elect. This is following the general election that was held on 9th of August, 2022. This ceremony is conducted in accordance with Article 141 of the Constitution, which requires that the swearing-in of the president-elect shall be in public before the Chief Justice. It also requires that the president-elect shall be sworn in on the first Tuesday following the seventh day, following the day on which the election is declared to be valid. It also requires that the president-elect assumes office by taking and subscribing the oath or affirmation of allegiance and the oath or affirmation for the execution of functions of the office as prescribed in the third schedule of the Constitution. This ceremony is therefore conducted uh, in accordance with Section 13.2 of the Assumption of the Office of President Act which provides that the oath or affirmation shall be administered to the president-elect by the chief registrar before the chief justice, not earlier than 10 a.m. 
and not later than 2 p.m. Ladies and gentlemen, today, 13th day of September 2022, is the first Tuesday following the seventh day, following the date on which the election was declared to be valid. I also confirm that uh, the time now is within the prescribed time and within the provisions of the Assumption of Office of the President Act. May I now request the Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya and the First Lady in waiting to come forward so that you may be formally introduced by the Chief Justice to the nation. Mr. President-elect. Distinguished ladies and gentlemen, all Kenyans, I have the honor and privilege to introduce the President-Elect of the Republic of Kenya, Constitution of Kenya in the presidential election held on the 9th August 2022, and whereas the chairperson of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission delivered a notification of the results. 10B of the Constitution of Kenya, I, Martha Karambu Kome, Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya, do hereby introduce to the people of Kenya, the President-elect, His Excellency, Honorable Dr. Ruto William Samoy, and invite him to take his place in the inauguration day. forward together with the first lady in waiting.
Aye. Aye. William Samoei Ruto. In full realization. In full realization. Of the high calling. Of the high calling. I assume as president. I assume as president of Kenya. Of the Republic of Kenya. Who swear. That I will be faithful. That I will be faithful. And bear true allegiance. And bear true allegiance. To the Republic of Kenya. To the Republic of Kenya. That I will obey. That I will obey. Preserve. Preserve. Protect, protect and defend this constitution and defend this constitution of Kenya of Kenya as by law established as by law established and all other laws and all other laws of the Republic of the Republic and that I will protect and that I will protect and uphold and uphold the sovereignty the sovereignty integrity integrity and dignity and dignity of the people of Kenya of the people of Kenya so help me God so help me God tumpongeze kwa makofi anapoendelea which is the oath of due execution of office of the president President, Mr. President-elect, please repeat after me. I, I, William Samoei Ruto, swear, swear, that I will truly, in the office of President of the Republic of Kenya, of the Republic of Kenya, that I will do diligently discharge that I will diligently discharge my duties, my duties and perform my functions and perform my functions in the office of president in the office of president of the Republic of Kenya of the Republic of Kenya and I will do justice and that I will do justice to all to all in accordance with this constitution in accordance with this constitution as by law established as by law established and the laws of Kenya and the laws of Kenya without fear without fear favor favor affection affection or ill will or ill will so help me god so help me god tumpongeze tena kwa makofi Rais watano wa Jamhuri ya Kenya. Tumpongeze wananchi. Asante. Pongezi pongezi mheshimiwa rais. The president is now appending his signature to the first oath that is the oath of allegiance of the office of president. After the president is done, he will then sign the oath of due execution of the functions of the office of president. The Honorable the Chief Justice is also appending her signature on the first set of documents, that is the oath of allegiance. Once the Chief Justice has appended her signature. The oaths are then sealed with the seal of the Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya. His Excellency the President is now signing the last set of documents, which is the certificate of inauguration. This certificate it confirms that this ceremony today has taken place. His Excellency the President has now finished signing the two oaths of office.
and the certificate of inauguration. The Honorable the Chief Justice is signing on the last set of documents whereupon they will be sealed with the seal of the Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya. Uh, may I ask the Honorable the Chief Justice to come forward for the presentation of the certificate. Mr. Your Excellency the President, please, for the presentation of the certificate. Muombe ainue certificate ju wanda inchi waweze kuona cheti ambacho ametia sahihi and there we have it his excellency honorable william samoi ruto president of the republic of kenya the swearing in ceremony for the deputy president elect and may I ask the deputy president elect and Pastor Dokas to come forward to take the oath of office. May I request that you place your left hand on the Constitution. And uh, we will begin with the oath of allegiance of the Deputy President. And may I ask request, Mr. Deputy President-elect, to repeat after me, I, I, Regali Dachagua, do swear that I will be faithful, that I will be faithful, and bear true allegiance, and bear true allegiance to the Republic of Kenya, to the Republic of Kenya, that I will obey, and that I will obey, preserve, preserve, protect, protect and defend this constitution and defend this constitution of kenya as by law established as by law established and all other laws and all other laws of the republic and that i will protect and that i'll protect and uphold uphold the sovereignty the sovereignty the integrity integrity and dignity of the people of kenya and the dignity of the people of Kenya. So help me God. So help me God. Tumpongeze kwa makofi mweshimi wa naibu wa rais. I regardi gashagwa. Do swear. Do swear. That I will always. That I will always. Truly and diligently, truly and diligently, <laughs> truly and diligently, truly and diligently, serve the people, serve the people, and the Republic of Kenya and the Republic of Kenya in the office of Deputy President in the office of the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya of uh, the Republic of again let's take it again I Asante I regarding Gashagua do swear do swear that I will always that I will always truly and diligently truly and diligently serve the people serve the people and the Republic of Kenya and the Republic of Kenya in the office 
in the office of the Deputy President of the Deputy President of the Republic of Kenya that I will diligently discharge that I will diligently discharge my duties my duties and perform my functions and perform my functions in the said office in the said office to the best of my judgment to the best of my judgment that I will at all times that I'll at all times when so required when so required faithfully and truly faithfully and truly give my counsel give my counsel and advice to the president and advice to the president of the republic of kenya of the republic of kenya that i will do justice to all that i will do justice to all without fear without fear favor favor affection affection or ill will or ill will and that i will not that i will not directly or indirectly Thank you very much. The Deputy President has also taken the two oaths of office. He is appending his signature now to the first oath. That is the oath of allegiance to the office of the Deputy President. The oath in terms of wording is exactly the same as that taken by His Excellency the President. The second oath that the, His Excellency the Deputy President took is the oath of due execution of the functions of the office of Deputy President. The Chief Justice is now appending her signature to countersign the first oath. And just like the oath Deputy President has finished signing his the two oaths, the Chief Justice is signing the last set. And like the President, His Excellency the Deputy President does not sign the certificate of inauguration. The one that is signed by the present the oath to the deputy president elect at the front of the mace, please. Your Excellencies, very distinguished Kenyans, ladies and gentlemen, it is now my honor, before I hand over the certificates, to introduce the Deputy President, Honorable Igavi Gashagwa, to the nation. Tumpongeze kwa makofi. Mweshimiwa Rigadi Gashagwa, ambaye sasa ni naibu wa rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya. That, whereas Honorable Gashagwa Rigadi was on the 15th August 2022, declared as the duly erected on the 9th August 2022, and whereas the chairperson of the Independent Electoral and Boundaries Commission delivered written notification of the results of the election to the Office of the Chief Justice on the 15th of August 2022, pursuant to the provisions of Article 10 b of the Constitution of Kenya, and having taken the oath, I, Martha Karambu Kome, the Chief Justice of the Republic of Kenya, do hereby present to you, the people of Kenya, the Deputy President, Honorable 
Bigabi Gashagua and present him. Tumpongeze sasa. Tumpongeze sasa kwa makofi mweshimiwa naibu wa rais wa Jamhuri ya Kenya mweshimiwa Rigathi Gashagua congratulations your excellency thank you thank you very much we will now have some photographs thank you very much they may now be joined by the honorable the chief registrar Thank you very much. They may now be joined by, with His Excellency, the Deputy President. Thank you very much. They may now be joined with the First Lady, Her Excellency, Mama Rachel Ruto and Her Excellency Pastor Dokas Rigavi. table thank you thank you very much we will now have the last photograph taken his excellency the deputy president together with her excellency pastor Dokas Rigadi your Excellency the President, you may retreat to your seat. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I now wish to invite the Honorable the Chief Registrar of the Judiciary to hand over the briefcase containing the oaths and the certificate of inauguration to the head of the public service, Dr. Joseph Kinyua. Thank you very much. May I now kindly invite all of us to stand as we have the Miss Lord to signify. Thank you very much. I now welcome the Honorable the Chief Justice to take her seat at the main pavilion and request uh, the rest of us to kindly take our seats. That, ladies and gentlemen, marks the end of the judicial function of this ceremony and I wish to invite the master of ceremony to continue with the rest of the program. To now most humbly request His Excellency Honorable Uhuru Kenyatta 
to proceed to the inauguration arena to hand over instruments of power to His Excellency Honorable William Ruto, President of the Republic of Kenya. He will be escorted by the Chief of the Defense Forces, General Robert Kibochi. za mamlaka na uongozi kwa sheria upito wa mamlaka zana hizo ni katiba ya jamhuri ya Kenya na kitara cha kijeshi ukipenda presidential ceremonial sword kwa kizungu mwanzo kabisa mheshimiwa rais daktari William Samoei Ruto atakabidhiwa na kala ya katiba ya jamhuri ya Kenya iliyopitishwa mwaka elfu mbili na kumi na kala hii ya katiba ikiwa ni ishara kuwa taifa litaongozwa kwa uongozi thabiti ambao utazingatia kanuni zote zilizorodheshwa katika katiba hii may i on i request your excellency honorable william ruto to move forward and receive the instruments of power cha kukabidhiwa zana za mamlaka na uongozi Mheshimiwa Rais Daktari William Samoe Ruto sasa atakabidhiwa kitara cha kijeshi yani Presidential Ceremonial Sword Kitara hiki kimetengenezwa kwa mpini wa chuma cha pua ama stainless steel halikadhalika nchi yake imepambwa kwa dhahabu Kitara hiki kinadhihirisha kudhibiti inchi na ulinzi wake. Kwa kawaida kitara hiki ukabidhiwa rais anayechukua hatamu ya uongozi kuashiria uhamisho wa mamlaka na usimamizi wa vyombo vya dola. Kama ilivyo kawaida kama makamanda wa kijeshi waendapo vitani ukibeba kitara kuashiria wao ndio wanatoa amri. Hivyo basi. Kwa kukabidhiwa kitara hiki Mheshimiwa Rais Daktari William Samoei Ruto anakuwa kirasmi ndiye amiri jeshi mkuu wa majeshi President of the Republic of Kenya and Commander in Chief of the Defence Forces, Honorable William Ruto. Niombe kuheshimiwa Rais kwa heshima. Niombe tuwe na kipindi kikupi cha picha. Picha ya kwanza ni yake Mheshimiwa Rais watano wa Jamhuri ya Kenya, Mheshimiwa William Ruto. Your Excellency the President kaidli yuwa foto. Asante, picha ya pili ni ya mweshimi wa rais watano wa jamhuri ya Kenya na rais wane wa jamhuri ya Kenya. Kaidli yuwa excellency. Naomba sasa picha ya tatu ni muombe mheshimiwa naibu wa rais Rigathi Gachagua augane nao kwa picha ya tatu. Naomba sasa ni waalike mheshimiwa Rachel Ruto, mheshimiwa Margaret Kenyatta na pasta dorka zorigadi wa ugane nao kwa picha ya mwisho
Asante sana. I wish now to most humbly request Your Excellency Honorable Uhuru Kenyatta and former First Lady Margaret Kenyatta to retreat and take our position at the main arena. Asante, niombe turudi kwenye jukwa rasmi. Niombe tena kwa heshima mheshimiwa naibu wa rais Rigathi Gashagua, Pastor Dorcas Gashagua na Mama Rachel Ruto tuweze kurudi kwenye viti rasmi, kwenye jukwa rasmi. Tuende tuketi kwenye jukwa rasmi kwa heshima. Na sasa nitaomba Chief of Defense Forces aweze kumsindikiza Mheshimiwa Rais wa Tano wa Jamhuri ya Kenya Mheshimiwa William Ruto ni muombe Mheshimiwa Rigathi Gashagua and Pastor Dorcas kindly if we could join the prayers kindly for prayers Stand up! nitaomba Bishop Mark Karioki aweze kuja kuongoza maombi rasmi to dedicate the presidency and the instruments of power to the Lord. Niombe kwa heshima tuweze kuwa na maombi rasmi to commit their excellencies to the Lord and also the instruments of power. Bishop Mark Karioki. Your Excellency, the President of the Republic of Kenya, Honorable William Samoy Ruto, and your deputy, the first thing that you do after being inaugurated as the president and the deputy of the Republic of where you are, And all the Kenyans who are watching from home, those of you who are watching from different places on the media, I would like you to join us as we pray. If you could go on your knees, let the whole nation go on its knees as we pray to God. Our Father and our God, we bow before you this moment. Because you are the Lord God who answers prayer. Lord, we cried out to you and you heard our prayers. And today you have proved to the world that you are the God who can change a chicken seller to a president. that you are the God who is the altar. You will give him the wisdom that is required to lead this nation. That you will give to him the wisdom you gave to Daniel in the land of Babylon. That you will give to him the wisdom you gave to Joseph in the land of Egypt. You will give to him the wisdom to fight corruption. You will give to him the wisdom of forgiveness. That you will give to him the wisdom of mending and repairing the economy of this nation. I pray, O oh God, that you will order his footsteps, that you will keep them united. That they shall not be separated, but in your fear, O oh God, they shall serve the people of this nation. Lord, I pray that you will give to the president the tongue of the wise and the tongue of the eloquent, that as he addresses this nation, your favor will be upon him. We pray that your favor will be upon him even as he talks to world leaders that he will speak that which you have spoken. 
I pray that in the name of Jesus, you will cause him to be an example of forgiveness in this nation. That there shall be no revenge because of what may have that of one shall not feel superior to the people. Father, I pray for their families that you will keep them in perfect health, that you will protect them, and that, Lord, your favor will be upon them. We thank you and we bless you as we dedicate our president, William Samoy Ruto, and his family, and the deputy Rigadiga Chagwa into your able hands, that, Lord, you shall be glorified in their lives. We thank you and we bless you because we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 We would like to blow the shofar. You may now arise in your exercises. into the land which I am giving to them. Wherever you set your foot, that will be land that I have given to them. Be strong and courageous, for you are the one who will lead these people to possess the land. Be strong and very courageous. Be careful to obey the instructions Moses gave you. Do not deviate from them, turning either to the right or to the left. Then you will be successful in everything you do. Study this one of instructions continually. Meditate on this on eight day and night. So you will be sure to obey everything written in it. Only then will you prosper and succeed in all you do. And your excellency, sir, the first gift that you receive on your inauguration is this Bible that I have read to you. Tumpongeze kwa makofi anapopokea Biblia kutoka kwa Bishop Mark Kariuki. May I now most humbly request your excellencies Richard Ruto after that one for Excellencies, Richard Ruto, you are...